Hello YouTube! Today I want to talk to you about North Dakota. Now, I know what's up. North Dakota is the state that gets picked on all the time. When people are trying to think of the most rinky-dink little state that doesn't have anything exciting going on there, usually their minds immediately go to North Dakota. I've been dealing with this problem my entire life, but I love it there. It's funny how a place can feel like home when you've never actually really lived there, and most of your memories of the place are stories borrowed from your parents and grandparents. I was born in Bismarck, North Dakota, but we moved away before I even turned one year old. A lot of my relatives still live there now though, so it's a really special place for me to visit. Mostly, North Dakota is about family. It's about reconnecting with the people you love, remembering and sharing things like traditional German food. This is German Fleisch Keeper <laughs> Pretty good. You guys ready to see the most amazing food in the entire world? This is a caramel roll. Oh, they're so good. I could eat them all day. Well, eat another one then. <laughs> Grandma, how many caramel rolls do you think you've made me in my life? Eh, yeah, worry about calories later. I don't know. <laughs> and not so traditional food. Dad, what are you about to try? Tiger meat. And you want to explain what it is real quick? Well, it's actually, I don't actually like, uh, like grind up tigers or anything. It's, uh, <laughs> it's raw hamburger with well. spices in. It's delicious. I used to serve it when I owned the bar. I told him I'd film it, but I wasn't going to try it. Yeah. I'm not into it. It's Ugh. raw. I know. What do you think? Delicious. Ugh. No. <laughs> not doing it. It's about remembering the past. So my grandma has all these photo albums that she always brings out when we come to visit. And I just wanted to show you this one picture from our trip to Hawaii. There's me. I was always adorable, right guys? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> In your own eyes, yep, all the time. <laughs> Wait, hold on. For just for that, I'm gonna show them this picture, Dad. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I was always adorable too. <laughs> I see where you get it from. And look at more embarrassing pictures of me. Check this out. <laughs> <laughs> it's about seeing what my parents' lives were like before I was even born. We're in Bismarck right now. Hey, Mom and Dad, what are we doing right now? Right now we're dragging Maine. <laughs> do, you want, do you want to explain what dragging Maine means? Well, before I was 21 and you won a party, you would just you'd get with your buddies, you'd hop in a vehicle, and you'd just cruise up and down Maine Street. That so, thrilling life. <laughs> and Tina, right up here, this building right here, this is the actual place where the front page tavern used to be. This is where I met your mother, right? Ooh, right. where? Right here. In this bar. Yep. I'll show you right up here by the tree. Yep. And getting to experience that life a little bit for myself. This is the Midway Tavern. This is the bar that my dad used to own. You're a pretty cool guy back in the day, weren't you, Dad? I'm still pretty cool, aren't I? <laughs> We're playing bar bingo! Check this out! I even learned how to sing some German songs from my grandparents. I think I'm the youngest person to ever sing in this choir. I spent a lot of time with my grandma while I was in North Dakota. She's a pretty incredible woman, even if she does seriously crack me up sometimes. What you looking for, Grandma? Huh? What you looking for in there? Anybody want whatever you want, you can have. Yeah? You can have whatever you want, Mom. Why don't you go try something on? I think it's a little out of my style. <laughs> you got some hot jeans, Grandma. These cucumbers or zucchinis, Grandma? These are zucchini. Yeah? They're just here for you to take? Anybody can take whatever they want. This is... <laughs> One thing I do have to say, though, is that I learned on this trip that retirement centers have come a long way. A long, long way. I don't really get to visit North Dakota very often. It's expensive to fly there, and it's hard to take time in our busy schedules to just slow down for a couple of days. But these trips are so, so important to me. We only get so much time with the people we love, and it's up to us to make sure that we use that time to the very fullest, even when our lives seem too busy. We're never that busy. Not when there are places like North Dakota to visit. So I was gonna go up and investigate this cool old abandoned house for you, but I am way too afraid of grasshoppers for that to happen. So we're just gonna get some zoomed in exploring from the road over here. Look at that. So cool. Would you live in that house, Nick? I would. Yeah? It's a nice looking house. Probably have to fix it up a little bit. Yeah. A little plywood, a little drywall. This is disgusting. Watch what happens when I step over here. Ah! Ah! Grasshoppers everywhere! Ah! Can you even see these? 
Ah! And hey, you know how much I love filming adorable children, but I don't really know any, so I usually end up filming children that I don't know? Well, my cousin Mandy just had a baby, and she gave me permission to film him being cute for as long as I wanted. Best day ever. So this is Chance. He's adorable, and I love him. <laughs> That's all for now, YouTube. And if you don't get to see your family very often, do me a favor and go tell them how much you love them. Thanks for watching.